fail. Welcome back to the pink envelope. I have a brand new, as in brand new, brand new, brand new entertainment or hostess, whatever you want to call it, subscription box. So I think we'll lean in a little bit more on what we're officially going to title this once we've unboxed it, but the name of the box is Simply Hosted, Your Seasonal Table Made Simply Elegant. I think we finally have another entertainment subscription box, but I want to dive in because I've seen nothing and I know nothing before we make any judgments. So when I was looking them up, Simply Hosted is quarterly, so four times a year. It's $249, but they do offer prepaid discounts. So I think when I was looking, if you subscribe for a year, so you buy all four boxes, you save like $20 per box and you get free shipping. If you go quarter to quarter, shipping's $18 in the US. So that's about $38 savings per box. So keep that in your head as you're thinking about this. Coupon code PINK10 gets you 10% off your first box in a subscription. She is running a special. If you subscribe to Simply Hosted annually, so all four boxes up front, she is gonna give you 10% off the total price for the annual subscription. So let me just, where to put my, oh my gosh. I was looking for my phone. It was in my hand. So founding members will pay, this is an estimate, but I wanna get this number out there. That's 916, so it's under $1,000 for an entire year of entertaining. But then you get another 10% off of that, which is about $100 savings. Plus shipping is $18. That adds up really quick, 18 times four is 72. So as I say, I say this with uh, FabFitFun, with Beachly, there's a bunch of them that have really big incentives for subscribing annually. If you like what you see here, subscribe annually. Now I will tell you that um, the offer for the founding members for the additional 10% on the annual expires December 1st. So you don't have a short amount of time, you actually have an entire month, but you don't have a long, long time to think on it. Of course, as we're opening this and you're noodling this out, mapping it out, running your numbers, if you have questions, please leave them below. The owner and myself will be down in the comments ready to help you guys with any questions you may have. And with a brand new box, there usually are quite a few questions. And you can join our Ask the Pink Envelope private Facebook group. I'll put that URL at the top of the description down there if you feel more comfortable chatting in a private setting. So this begins shipping November 12th and it features curated tablescapes for easy hosting. You'll get anywhere from 12 to 20 seasonal items and they do give back with every purchase. Oh, okay. So I'm gonna tilt it so that we can see inside and then I'm gonna slide it over on my stool because I think it'll be easier for us to open it there. But here's what I'm seeing on top. There's tissue paper, ribbon, and a hand or a note of some sort and then a handwritten note behind it. Simply Hosted will include a variety of seasonal tabletop decor, menus, recipes, and grocery lists to create a beautiful dinner party for six. Your table will be perfectly coordinated, not matched. Yes, thank you. We need coordinated in our life, not matching. With items that can be used throughout the season, Simply Hosted is for busy people, who want to share the joy of gathering around the table with their friends and family. It's for people who appreciate the nice details but don't want the stress of pulling it all together. Let me tell you, I love the nice details but I do not want the stress of pulling it all together. So for a Halloween party, I got the shaker and spoon Halloween. I'll link that one up here. We got rave reviews, rave reviews for our super cool Halloween drinks and we didn't do anything but take the mezcal out of another subscription box that we had and we were done. Super easy. All right, uh, it's a note from the owners. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then let's see what's inside here. Welcome to Simply Hosted Winter. I'm not gonna flip through this too much. Oh yeah, this looks like it has spoilers all in it. We're just gonna set it right here and I'll loop back to that in just a second because y'all know me, I absolutely love love a surprise. 
Okay, an elegant winter menu. And oh my gosh, so this is the menu. It says the it lists the appetizer, the main course, and the dessert. And then it has a list of stress-free hostess hacks. It's like literally, you know what you're serving. And here, step by step, is how to set things up without having the stress of having to figure out what are my next steps. Love. Oh my gosh, you can use this year round. Obviously you can use it to set for a dinner party, but you should save these just like we save all of our other recipe cards. Like we were just talking about in the taste of home or what is it? Yeah, the taste of home box, simply, what is it? Simply something taste of home box. We were just talking about recipes from there and saving them. Well, we have an herb roasted tenderloin and it has everything you need to know to make this right here. There is a picture, there is the recipe and there is the instructions. I have never made a tenderloin like this, like a roasted tenderloin at our house. Never. I've never even thought about it. And we are so sick of our same old recipes. I am a hundred percent doing this. We also have parish dinner. So at our church, we have like little groups that meet up. They're not Bible studies. They're just really kind of doing life in community together. And we always sit right around food. So we call it parish dinner. Um, and we have one guy who always cooks. He is like all star and always cooking, but maybe I will have the confidence to cook something for a large group. I don't mind bringing sides. I've never done a main dish or I rarely do main dishes. Maybe this is what I need to get the swift kick in the pants to be the one who will say, I will make a roasted tenderloin. Cheesy scallop potatoes with herbs de Provence. Let me tell you, I love scalloped potatoes. Absolutely one of my favorites and everything you need to know here. Then we have Simple Pleasures, great addition to our winter recipes. Oh, there is a drink and a salad on here of both that look absolutely delightful. So I always love harvest salads. I do almost all my salads with the balsamic vinegar. So I am super excited about that. But this, this goes back to what I was saying with shaker and spoon. We look like we knew what was going on with how cool that recipe was. So I cannot wait to try this one. And then we have an easy, elegant, flourless chocolate tort. Does that mean I can eat it because it's gluten-free? There's no flour? Y'all, this box may be this thing that I, <laughs> I needed in my life, both entertainment wise and cooking wise. I feel like as a busy working mom, I'm not against cooking. I enjoy it. I want to put on jazz music and I want to pour a glass of wine and I want to be a part of that experience, but I have no idea what to cook. And sometimes after I've been working, I usually sit down at my desk at seven and I get up between four and five. I, that's will be like the first time I have like gotten up, gotten up to do something. And then I'm like brain dead and I can't think of anything to cook. Here is a short rib braised in red wine. Oh my gosh. That sounds so, so good. And the instructions on these cards are very specific. The ingredients, notes of things to watch for, pairings that go with these items, plus the directions. So we haven't even gotten into the box itself. And I am beyond impressed with just the presentation in the ease of throwing a dinner party and not having to do anything. You could literally sit down at your computer and put these items into whatever grocery shopping app. We use H-E-B, but there's Amazon, there's Walmart, there's a ton of them. Have the groceries delivered, get off work, start cooking, and everybody's gonna be like, how'd you pull off this amazing party? And you can be like, oh, well, you know, spare time. I'm just, I pulled it together in my spare time. This is crazy good. Okay, what do we, what is this guy right here? We have like a frosted berry wreath. I would love to put a fancy drink in the center of this guy. Yeah, so here it is, very lightweight. It's just a wreath with frosted berries on top. I'm going to, it hasn't been fluffed obviously. I'm going to assume that she's about to break down what exactly we're gonna use this for, but I wanna put a picture of a gorgeous drink or a bottle of champagne in the center of that. Super bad, oh, saving this ribbon to wrap Christmas gifts, please and thank you. They're little wrap.
wrapped gifts. Is this a table runner? I think it's a table runner. It is a table runner. Okay, so cute. Very winter specific, not Christmas. I love the colors or the lack of color, should I say, the neutrality of it, especially up against this pop of white. I love the neutral. This is what the back looks like. It's plain. I love, love, love this. Here, actually, I don't want to fold it like that. Let's see if I can spread it out under here. So not, not Christmas, which is a big request I get. Do I have boxes that send things that are winter, not Christmas specific? And that's definitely where we're moving right here. So this guy here is wrapped and it has the herbs from that recipe right here. So we already have an ingredient that's a unique ingredient that you probably wouldn't know how to get or where to get otherwise. She provided it and it has a cute little tag. Look at this tag real quick. Very, very, very well done. So what is in here? My little Paigey, who is my gift wrapper, she is the one who wraps all of our gifts for most everything, is gonna be so excited when she sees all this red ribbon. <laughs> hey, a blue Jolly Rancher. The kids are gonna be excited about that. Are these our napkins? I think these are our napkins. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six napkins. Okay, you guys, there's some of y'all who are gonna be elated because you always get stuck with two or four napkins. There are six square fringed napkins in here. Let me just kind of shake up that. Oh yeah, they lay beautifully once again, screaming winter, but man, this is very winter. These could be used year round. Like that's a staple item for <laughs> change out the ring you're putting on it. And then there's more little presents at the bottom. This is heavy, whatever it is. Assuming that it's probably breakable. So not just the ribbon, but y'all save these boxes. This will make your Christmas gift wrapping a cinch if you have all of these guys on hand when it's time to wrap. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. What is it though? It's, I mean, look at the glass. It's Stunning, very, very elegant. Oh, I think it's a candle that you would sit in the center of this tablescape. Yep. Here's your white candle that you're just gonna drop in the center of, oh man, why can I not think of the name of this glass? It'll come to me later, right when I, like in the middle of the night when I don't need the information. So, hold on. There's another one in here. It's a set. Okay, let's do this real quick, just because it'll be fun. Let me take all of these extra things off. Let me put the cloth out and let's just treat this like a table um, and just see what we see. Okay, so I feel like I can kind of see things better and play with them a little bit better here. There is another one that looks like these guys. So let's pop him over next. Okay, we've got a set of three, which I love. I do not like decorating with even numbers. As you see, I put three napkins down. I have six to choose from, but I went with three. It's just the way I am. So let me slide this over. We'll put this guy over here. This napkin, super cute. And then we still have this guy here. napkin rings but you guys look at this napkin ring i love how over the top blingy these are these genuinely speak to me so let me put one on a napkin real quick i'll just take this one here and this napkin here 
That is so wonderful. Very, like, once again, coordinating, but not matching. Uh, items that can be used over and over again within one season. Very thankful she went winter, not Christmas, because if she shipped this, you know, mid-November, I don't remember when she said, but something in November, you know, we couldn't use it like a month later. But this will push us well into March. Basically, we'll have everything we need to go till she releases that next box. These are fabulous. So let me kind of set my tablescape here and then we're gonna chat for a sec. Oh my gosh, you guys. I knew that these looked familiar, but I couldn't figure out why and I found it after I got off the video. These are a replica of the jeweled snowflake napkin rings from Pottery Barn that are already sold out. I am so, so excited about these. So in this box, we got the entertainment centerpiece you can put whatever you want in the center. A bottle of red wine, in my opinion, would be pretty fabulous inside there. We have the centerpiece built out as a whole with the table runner, the set of six napkins plus over-the-top bling snowflake napkin rings, three centerpiece votives with three white candles inside, we have a winter menu where it's literally, if you wanna just cut it across there and have it on display, this is printed and done for you. Tips and tricks on how to host. One, two, three, four, five, six recipes, plus one of them calls for a unique ingredient, which she has included. And then we have this booklet here. It breaks down each item, like it says these are made of cotton and, oh, mercury glass. I was like, that is the word I can think of. The three mercury glass votive holders, which I wanna like just kinda run through on quality first box. We gotta talk about it. And I feel like it's important that I go there. These are great quality, like great. The mercury glass, sometimes mercury glass can be very murky in spots it's not supposed to be because it's poorly made. I feel like I've combed these over pretty good and I don't see murky spots on them at all. And they're like double walled. So there's like a, a gap between that back and the front that is well placed. Candles, you can put anything in there, scented, non-scented, that's pretty easy breezy. The napkins are a great quality, just a basic cotton, cotton napkin. I don't know what you guys can see of these. These are middle quality. They're not over the top luxury. I would not equal these to Pottery Barn or West Elm. They're not quite that quality. I would say, man, I'm thinking of stores here in San Antonio that wouldn't help you much because they're not mainstream, but like your high-end party stores, like you can go in there and you can get like um, party supplies. Hold on, I know how I can figure this out. Have y'all ever ordered from Mary Mary or Packed Party? I, equivalent to those. So don't think Tim U, but don't think West Elm. It's right through the middle there on quality. I love, love, love them. I just can't tell what you guys can see on the camera. And I wanna make sure that we are on the same page when it comes to these. Uh, Table Runner, also excellent quality. Uh, this guy, excellent quality. He looks like all of our other garland wreaths that we received, he's great. And then the print quality, ink and paper on these are excellent quality. Excellent, you could absolutely share these and be proud of the work, more than proud of the work on these. So, tell me what you think. We have kind of had a weird run through with entertainment boxes. And every entertainment box is different because everybody entertains differently. And so when we hear a hostess box, we're always like, ooh, what you got for us? Uh, we've not met a hostess box we don't love yet, but I would love to hear y'all's feedback on this one. This is her very first box. So if you're leaving feedback, I want it to be very positive. And we use compliment sandwiches around here. I just wanna be very, very clear. So tell us some things that you're absolutely loving that are right on track. But if you wanna add a little wish or two, like, oh, I love this, but I also wish that, 
you can do that as well. Uh, I've talked to the owners. We had a little uh, Zoom call and they are absolutely wonderful. She is so, so sweet. She's been entertaining for years. So this is her love language, which is obvious because these recipes are simply delightful. And one of the other things she mentioned is that they have a mission for bringing people together around the table and they're partnering with Feeding America to help others do the same. So when you buy a subscription box, they will make a donation that will provide meals to a family of four for a week. So that shows you just how mission-minded in her personal life and in her business she is to get people to come around the table. Simply hosted. Well done. I wore this blue, like this, this frosty winter blue, because I was like, well, I don't know if it's Christmas or if it's winter, and it works excellent with this tablescape. <laughs> I'm so proud of my color choice. Well done. Thank you so much for trusting me with your first box. I'm so excited to see where you're going to go next. Uh, TPE followers. We have so much on deck, you guys. So tomorrow, we're doing a midnight release with Steal It box. Ooh, ooh. So they're re-releasing some stuff. And we're going to talk about it. And then uh, I have a, like a... I've, call, I've been calling it the Crate Joy haul because I got all the boxes from Crate Joy, but they're great gift options under 50 bucks. So that's a great one to check out if you're shopping for affordable and cheaper gift items. I have a brand new book subscription. That is really cool. Coming up, I got a box called Mighty Nest. Very cool subscription, planet-friendly eco box that I am very excited to share with y'all. Of course, Evergreen Lane is coming. And then, I mean, it just keeps going from there. So if you have not already, please subscribe to the channel. You also can be following me over on Instagram. We got a lot going on over there as well. And we're gonna be posting, posting, posting. We are not keeping the three days a week schedule. Normally I am on Sunday, Tuesday, Friday, and then we have Ben and Sabrina Thursdays. We're just posting. We're just posting, 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 and we'll do that all the way into December because I don't wanna miss something that could potentially help you guys. So I'm trying to show as much as possible so you guys can run all the way through your checklist, get all of your shopping done so that you have enough time to, you know, do a little shopping for yourself. I hope that you guys are having an absolutely amazing day. And if you did subscribe to my channel, I'm gonna see you guys later. Bye y'all.